Hello and welcome back to the 12th episode of our Sim Self Chaos. I know that the last episode only had one day or one house and that's how this one is going to be also just because I have a limited amount of time and these are really fun to film but also at the same time they're easier to film and shorter. So they're just nice to be able to do. I like them. You guys seem to like them as a nice break between the normal things on the channel. So let's just jump right in. We are playing at house number two today. So let's see what's gonna be happening at house number two. Okay. Get gold on an incognito costume party. I do not even know what that means or how to do that. However, I'm definitely willing to try. This is the last house that we were in. This house has Nikki and Allie and Zero, Lynn, Anuvi, Trace, and Demi. So hopefully we will not get one of the children this time as we see who's going to be throwing this costume party after I get our new housemates picked. Okay, so let's see if I can figure out what in the world an incognito costume party is because Allie is going to be having it. Okay, Allie's throwing a party, and we have to see what that even means. Allie is right here. Uh, she has a fear of crowded places, <laughs> and she wants to stargaze with Gavin Richards and complete a work task. And her job is a table cleaner at the fast food place, and she does not even have a work task to complete. So we cannot do that. But she goes to work in eight hours and she's feeling pretty good. She's a little bit tired. Her bed is where? In here. Oh gosh, do Trace and Demi have a difficult? Pick a number one to two. I don't see a two in your contacts. Who I, do you want to call? Oh no, she didn't. Pick a number one to two. That would be two. Okay, good. They do not have a difficult family dynamic. But apparently they're in there fighting with each other right now. Okay, so the event is going to have to be today, which is going to be snowy, but let's see, add an event, an incognito costume party. Anyone can throw a party, but a costume party, well, that gets people talking and laughing, and if they're laughing at you, who cares? You're already incognito, remember? So it's just a costume party? That's actually very cool. Okay, so Allie is going to be our host. And then we're going to invite all of our SimSelf friends who don't live in our house. So let me take off the ones who live here. Oh, there's too many of us to get everybody in here. Heather, Lily, and Goose are not going to get invited because they were too far down the list. And Lynn, Zero, Anuvi, and Nikki are not invited because they live in the house. Okay, we're going to hire a caterer and we're going to hire a mixologist. And we're going to have it at our house. Let's give us until like 1 p.m. Let's do it at 1 p.m. Not at our house. Let's do it somewhere else. We're going to Strangerville to the bar in Strangerville for the party. So I'm just going to have her needs up as high as I can get them. By the time the party starts, we have like 12 hours from now. Oh, I forgot all of these people down here today. I mean, all the crap from yesterday is what I meant. Oh, there's no leftovers? Ugh, just an empty plate? Okay, we're gonna have to cook. Oh, she has work in two hours. She's gonna get home at 10, though. Oh, is Nikki squeamish? Pick a number one to two. The answer is two. No, she's not. Okay, I need her to get up and go ahead and eat now. Wait, she's also scared of swimming? What kind of fears does she have? Dang. <laughs> She has a fear of fire, fear of the dark, fear of swimming, and a fear of crowded places. <laughs> Allie. <laughs> Allie's got to be at work in an hour, and she just now started trying to make this food. She's not going to finish before she has to go. Okay, we'll finish the... Oh, she didn't get to finish. She's gone to work, and she's hungry. Hopefully, she'll take care of herself at work. She doesn't have to work too long, so she'll be back here at 10, and then we still have three hours before the party. Oh my gosh, the cat is up there eating the dang salad. Listen, Ocean, I can't tell you to do anything, but I need you to get off the counter. I was going to finish cooking that salad. Oh, I guess Lynn was. 
Lynn just came down and started. Oh, Lynn. <laughs> I knew if you made something over here. Mac and cheese. I'm putting it in the refrigerator. Oh, that salad is nasty. Yeah, she said. Ugh. I need you to eat, Allie, while you're at work. Come on. We've really got to do some cleaning up at the house, and I need you to be done eating. Nikki, could you clean up? Ocean, what you screaming about? Ocean is scared of what? The toilet or the sink? Wait, what's broken? The bathtub is broken? Look at Ocean just running in here. Link. Oh, Nikki likes idealist Sims. Pick a number one to two. The answer is one. Oh, yes, she does. Oh, my gosh. Ocean is also skittish, and now she's in here drinking the puddle. Aw. Baby Demi's playing with Ocean. Now Ocean's going to sit up here with Lynn. She's like, Mom, I'm very scared of all the things. Lynn's like, this baby stinks. Oh, my gosh. How did you get to feeling so bad, baby girl? Come over here and go potty. I can at least tell her to go potty and go to bed. Maybe she could ask her mom for a bath later. All right. Allie's home? Allie's home. You're not bathing that baby or doing anything with the baby. You're cleaning up the downstairs. Oh, my gosh. Look at Ocean. Passed out. That's not Ocean. <laughs> That's a stray. You're cleaning up all this mess. Clean up. Clean up everything. We're not keeping this nasty salad either. Clean it up. Oh, can I do this? Ask for help cleaning? I've never done this. Oh, I wanted to ask everybody for help cleaning. She's a loner. She wants to be alone, and instead she's throwing a whole party. Oh, our party's starting soon. We're not bringing the kids with us, just us. Oh, I forgot the party's not even here at our house. We don't have to worry about cleaning up. Let's go to the dang bar. Okay, I think I need to throw a quick little kitchen space up here because we have a caterer coming. So maybe just one of those like cooking, outside cooking things. Okay, so hopefully that's what we need. Oh my gosh, we're squeamish. Our girl is squeamish. She wants to earn some tips doing what? Fulfill an aspirational goal, which is to listen to music for two hours. You know what? Maybe we could do that. I'm going to put that on there. And we're going to listen to um, Americana music. And we're also going to put oh, our so costumes nice. on, right? Or did we not do that till right when the thing starts? Maybe we wait. Incognito costume party is about to begin. This will end any current events. Yes, let's start. Okay, make buffalo wing tea and a taco casserole. How random. Oh, look at it. People are showing up in their costumes. Allie's got her costume on. Nice. I love it. I need some of y'all to put your costumes on. Oh my gosh, look. That's Jessica's costume. <laughs> Also, Shona shows up as a an inmate. <laughs> okay, perfect. The people who are here don't have a costume because they're not technically part of the party. That sucks. I wish if they were here, you could be like, I would like to be part of the party or whatever. I don't even know how to make a taco casserole. Is that a thing? Oh, Jacqueline Mama is wearing the same outfit we are. That's great. Oh my gosh, who's dressed as a hot dog? Lizzie it. <laughs> Lizzie it is dressed as a hot dog. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. And randomly in the middle of it all is Travis Scott. Right there. Just hanging out. Oh wait, what? Allie is attracted to Jacqueline Mama. Maybe it's because y'all are wearing the same clothes, Allie. I need you to calm down about that. Oh my gosh. Here is my costume. I'm just dressed like a police officer. What? And I'm chatting with uh, Travis Scott. I'm sorry, but so far, Jessica wins. That is the best looking costume. If, oh, Cynthia has on the same costume in a different color. Oh my gosh, who else is coming in? Okay, Leanne is dressed like, I don't know, Batu maybe? Phil is a cheerleader. Jude is also wearing this outfit. Y'all, we have a whole band of them. They could perform for us a little 
Oh, look. Electra is also dressed as a police officer, and Wendy and Shona are both inmates. Oh, my gosh. Oh, and Lindsay is also an inmate. I love it. Oh, my gosh. Look who stomped in here being so mad is Katie dressed as a clown. Oh, my gosh. I love it. I love the costume party with all of us here. I'm so sad we couldn't fit everybody in. Okay, I need you to stop listening to music. You've got to do some other things. Is our caterer going to... El Faba, can you come over here and make us a cake, please? Am I going to have to make a cake? Because it says eat cake. Okay, I'm going to have to go make a cake. And I've got to talk about costumes with the guests. All right, we're over here cooking. Hey, if you come up to me, then we talk about your costume. Those are the rules. Since that's the main thing we have to do to try to get a gold. No, don't stop cooking. Oh my gosh, Amanda, you're standing in the way and she cannot finish cooking. Wait, where are you going with the cake batter? Allie, please resume the chocolate cake. Katz is also a cheerleader. I'm trying to tell people that I like their costumes. But I also need her to make this cake so I can get four people eating this cake at the same time. Girl, stop and make the dang cake. Thank you. Allie, just push that girl out your way. Come make this cake. There we go. Okay, great. Let's tell Leanne that we like her costume. Oh my gosh, Lizzieette's over here. Let's tell Lizzieette we like her costume as well. Okay, the cake is done. Wait, where did you just put it? On the floor. Wonderful. You know what? That's totally fine. We need to call everybody to the cake anyway. Oh, her queue is not full. Oh, she hates being around all these people. I'm sorry that she had to throw this party. I need you to talk. El Faba, I need you to get your butt up and cook something. You're the dang caterer. People are eating cake. People are eating cake. Okay, we did it. We ate. No, we didn't eat cake yet. One more person needs to eat a cake. Girl, come get a piece of cake. Get a piece of cake, Katie. Come on. There you go. Katie's got a piece of cake. Now eat it. Let's all eat it. It got real quiet. Oh my gosh, Thorn Bailey is here. Thorn, we can't have you acting foolish. Oh my gosh, we barely have a. I can't do these other ones. I don't know how to make a taco casserole. Oh my gosh, she got a sentiment with Jessica. We're gonna lose and we're gonna have to make another one. I'll have to figure out whatever buffalo wing tea is and a taco casserole and make sure I have those for next time. This has been hilarious. Look at the cop and the inmate dancing here while Jude is killing herself back here dancing like that. Look at that. They're all dancing in a line. All of our people at the party are dancing like that. Our girl's going to serve tofu tacos. I don't think anybody at our house has a high enough cooking skill to make taco casserole. Okay, well, we earned a bronze medal. Oh, that's so sad. That's okay. Everybody did great. Thank you for coming to the party. They're all saying goodbye. We are too. We're leaving. This was fantastic to see all the costumes, even though we did not get a gold. All right. Well, everybody's back home. Our girl... Hey, the garden salad somehow became normal while we were gone. I'm still going to try to clean up some stuff. She did get a couple of her things done that she wanted to, but we failed the actual thing that she wanted to do. The thing we spun for her to do. But we're going to get some of this mess up here cleaned up. I'm going to have her repair this. Actually, let's just replace it. We've got enough money. She can come clean this up here. All right, the only thing we have left to do is get her some food and get her in the bed. So she's going to come down here and get some leftovers. Our baby boy has made it down the stairs. He's coming to talk to Zero to ask her to read him a book. Oh, isn't that cute? He's like, hey, will you read me, please? And Demi just got level two movement, which means she can now come down the stairs. 
Oh, she's asking for comfort and petting the kitten. Listen, I don't think Anubi can give you comfort. Anubi needs to pee and eat and go to sleep. Okay, I'm sorry. I got distracted by Allie, who was cleaning up in here in the kitchen. Allie, clean up this glass, please, and then you can come upstairs and go to sleep. Nikki is just in the bed. She does not care. Her children are all over this house. There's enough people to take care of them, I guess. And that's going to do it. You guys let me know if you think we should do another incognito party or if we just mark it down as like failed so next time i have to roll two events maybe we do that if we don't complete it if it's something that cannot be completed in one in one play session one day then we're not penalized for it but something like this where we did it but we failed to get a gold we could create a punishment where like I have to roll two times for the next the next house, but I don't know. Y'all just tell me what you think. Um or do I just throw another costume party when I get Allie the next time until I get a gold? I just keep doing the costume parties. Oops, I realized I went over a little. <laughs> so anyway, I'm open to any suggestions that you have about it. And that is going to do it. Thank you so much for watching. I loved these costumes. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.